Day five, leveraging community to get faster results. Calling all ambitious women who are ready to rock the rest of 2019 and 2020. Okay, ladies, this is the official call. We are officially in the enrollment period for Soul Elite. You might be wondering what the heck is Soul Elite and how is it different from the other experiences you offer, Heather? Well, great question. So Soul Elite is a 12-month mastermind experience for the ambitious, successful go-getter. You are craving community. You are craving connection. You are craving sustainability and impact. You want to get to a place in your life where there's just something deep inside of your soul that wants to be expressed. And you also want to surround yourself with like-minded women who are on the same level. So these are the CEOs. These are the executive uh, women. These are the entrepreneurs. These are the ones who have already seen traditional success in their life, but they're just looking for that deeper connection. It involves retreats. It involves one-on-one coaching with me. We also have a team of game-changing other professionals and coaches who will be connecting with us in the next 12 months. Plus, you're walking through this experience with other like-minded women who are ready to pull back the curtains, show you how they got successful, share their amazing resources with you, and get vulnerable. So, This is an elite group of ladies, hence the reason why it's called Soul Elite, and I am so excited. We already have about six people inside. It's also an intimate group, and I'm just really excited to learn and connect with more of you. So head on over to heatherchauvin.com forward slash soul elite. All you have to do is fill out the application, and then I will personally read it and be in touch. If I don't think you're a good fit, that's okay. I will point you in the right direction, whether it's another program that I offer or if there's somebody else that I know that can be a good fit for you. So 2019, 2020 Soul Elite Experience is now open for enrollment. And when you apply before September 15th, you get added bonuses and discounts. So again, head on over to heatherchauvin.com forward slash Soul Elite and fill out your application today. Okay, I'm back, and today is the last day of the Freedom Unlocked, um, how to take, well, I don't even know what I'm calling it anymore, what did I call it? Freedom Unlocked, getting the tools you need to take back control of your time and energy, the little mini-series that I did on the podcast. All right, so I'm going to tell you about my own personal experience with leveraging community to get faster results, and this is in your own personal and professional life. It doesn't matter if your results that you desire are parenting-related, business-related, food, fitness, magic. And I'm going to talk about the first community that I was in and how it was a game-changer for my business, both personally and professionally. And I'm also going to be talking about Soul Elite and what it is. And um, I'm going to be very frank and honest about Soul Elite. Um, This is an elite mastermind with an intimate group of women in business. And when I say business, you don't need to own a business. I mean a professional woman who is established in her career. So this is somebody who loves quality. This is someone who is an action taker. This is somebody who enjoys personal development, wants to up-level, finds themselves um, in a little bit, not a pickle, um, but really feeling in your soul that there's something more that you desire. Coming up next week, I'm going to be talking about a hot seat uh, coaching call that I'm going to be doing where I'm going to actually be sending out applications for you guys to fill out. And this is for if you want to get some hot seat coaching with me um, to work on where you're at right now. No strings attached. It's like I'm giving away free value and I'm going to look at your calendar. I'm going to look in your business. I'm going to look in your professional life, our personal life, and I'm going to give you honest feedback and then you just run with it. Um, now I'm a seven figure business owner and it took me a, a little bit <laughs> a while to get here in my mindset. Um, 
for a long time, I thought a million dollars, a million dollars, a million dollars, I want a million dollars. And it wasn't the million dollar that I was after. It was uh, becoming that person who attracts that. But here's the kicker. I also did not want to run this level of a business while burning myself out. Because too often, I look at mentors, I look at role models, and they might be at the level that I want to be at or the ambitions or have accomplished things that I desire, but I don't like their lifestyle. I'm not attracted to the way that they live. I'm not attracted to the food that they eat, to the lack of disrespect that they have for their body or their mind uh, or the disconnect they have in their relationships or how they feel disconnected in their life. So your energy matters and how you show up makes an impact on who you attract in your life. So the more work I do on myself personally, the more um, I attract like-minded women. And so some people might be like, well, I'm not attracted to you at all, which is totally fine because like attracts like, right? We all have, we all have uh, values. And so some people might value being vegan. Some people might value, um, I don't know. I'm just randomly saying things right now. My point is people will always have like values. So if you have a desire inside of you to make a big impact in your life, to find the sense of um, ease and in like abundant health. And I mean that from the inside out. I don't just mean like making a fucking vision board and, and just sitting and praying. I mean, literally taking the strategic action to get there, but also being very productive with your time and working on you know, the inside job that you need to work on. So it's the spiritual aspect, it's the strategic business aspect, and it's also getting to that next level in your business. So if this is something you're interested in, then I want you to go to heatherchauvin.com forward slash soul, S-O-U-L elite. Um, Fill out that application. I will read it and review. And if you feel like you're a good fit or a good connection, um, I'll reach out. So that said, um, leveraging community to get faster results. I'm going to tell you about last year, but I've been, I've been investing in leveraging community for 10 years now. And the first year I didn't even know that I was missing community. I didn't even know that that was a cup that I needed. And a lot of ambitious women that I work with who are not used to masterminds and not used to being in collaborative groups of women have big wounds around co-creating their success with women who are here to help them rise, which is exactly what I'm all about. So I'm going to talk about last year, and then I'm going to talk about my first mastermind experience. Last year, um, and, and part of this year too, I inserted myself in community where I felt like I was the small fish. So you hear that quote around surround your, or you are the, what you know what I'm talking about, you are the people you surround yourself with or the five, oh my God, you are the sum of the five people you spend most time with. Totally paraphrasing that, but you get what I'm saying. Um, so I was getting to this point where I was tuning in with myself and I'm like, I'm ready to grow. I want to up level and I don't know what I need or want, but I want to be surrounded with amazing, brilliant women. And of course, not everybody I surround myself with is going to have the exact same values and lifestyle as me. And actually, a lot of communities that I was inserting myself with was a lot of um, ambitious, successful women, but a lot of them were burnt out. And so I could see where I could be of value to them. So I was inserting myself in these communities where I was surrounding myself and I'd say, hey, I have these these goals in my business or my personal life. This is my challenge. And the amazing thing was I inserted myself in these communities where I felt I didn't belong. Okay. That's key. I felt like I wasn't good enough to be around these women. I'm like, I'm not there yet. They're more successful than me. What are they going to think of me? I'm younger than them. Or, um, well, they're going to judge me. And I, I shrunk, like I got quiet. And then, you know, in some of these collaborative groups, when I was talking about my, um, my, you know, it was my turn. They're like, Hey, Heather, what's your challenges? And I would talk about it. 
this is what I talk about leveraging community. So people would say, you need to meet this person. Oh, I'm going to make an email introduction for this person. Oh, da, da, da. And some of these people that they were talking about, I'm like, oh, I know that person. Like I follow them or I've heard of them. And it was like making these very fast, quick connections. And this is the beauty of amazing collaborative connection with um, fabulous humans who are just here to say, how can I solve your problems for you? Um, oh, here's a connection for you. And I'm all about that. Like there's no competition here. It is like, there's like six, seven billion people in the world. Like guys, there's enough to go around. This is called abundant mindset. And I just kept putting myself in these communities and just feeling the discomfort because if you've been listening to me at all, you've heard me talk about over and over again, feel your discomfort, feel your fear, feel your grossness and just sit in it. And so I'd sit in it and then it would be like this stretch, right? I'd expand. And then a month would go by, two months would go by and I would re-enter that group situation. I go, oh, I feel like I belong now, right? Like I'm not as triggered. I feel like I'm here. And so you can watch yourself growing and expanding and learning and shifting. And so the point of what I'm trying to say is I've leveraged community to help me out, whether it's in my own personal life, I mean my physical in-person community. Uh, when I started my business and way before I started my business, I would create meetups. So I created a local meetup because I felt neglected um, locally and I felt isolated as an entrepreneur who worked out of her home. So I created a women's circle and we would just talk about women things and we'd have inspiring speakers come and I charged 10 bucks or 20 bucks a ticket and it grew and grew and grew. And then we were having 60 people show up and a hundred people show up. And then I actually kind of passed the baton off to somebody because I didn't want to run those groups anymore. So it was really amazing. And I actually remember doing this when I was in university, I think, um, I was my first year of university. I was a single parent, 19 years old, 20 years old. And I actually started a meetup for young moms. And I attracted two or three people. <coughs> it wasn't an amazing group, but two or three people who, uh, one of them I still talk to today. We always go back and forth on Instagram. And um, we would just go to, we'd have play dates together. And we would talk about how isolating it felt being a young mom in society where you're always being judged and people are like, oh, how did this happen? And, you know, people are just staring at you all the time when you are anything against the norm. So I uh, created those meetups, leveraging community to get results faster. Now I want to talk about my first community experience. When I started investing in myself in a coaching program, so I went to therapy forever, became a therapist, thought that was the only way you heal yourself. Little did I know that there is a whole wide world out there that nobody knows about. And I didn't know what coaching was. And I started taking, I took this thousand dollar coaching program online, didn't have any money for it, maxed out our credit cards. Uh, it was $300 a month times three or four or whatever. And, um, I had no money. Like I could not afford $300 a month for, I think four payments. And, but I, I fucking did it. Cause I knew I was going to, uh, we were going to get a divorce and life was going to be awful if I didn't. So I did that. And then after I took that program, I started seeing results and I became really close with the coach. And she said, Heather, I have this mastermind. It's for women in business. And I was very new in my business at that point, And I invested in this mastermind. Couldn't afford it, but I needed it, figured it out. I leveraged that community. And after that year, I remember talking to the coach and I said, I would not be where I am today without this community. And then from that community, I met my next mentor who was actually one of my colleagues in that group. And I started working with her. And then after working with her, I met somebody else and I always have mentors. I always have coaches. Every time I see a symptom in my life or a challenge that I feel I can't get through myself and I need additional support, I hire help. Now, this is part of my business model. I always make sure that, um, you know, I have enough money for that in my business model. If you have this lack mentality, you're always going to think I can do this myself. I can knuck I can white knuckle through and it's not going to get you very far. 
So when you're leveraging community, you are 10xing your results. You're coming together using the brain power of other people, their life experiences, and saying, okay, I'm here. And they're like, oh my gosh, I was there last year. I was there five years ago. I did X, Y, Z. Boom, 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 boom. Here's the people. Here's the path laid out for you. And if you are open to receiving help and open to receiving connection and collaboration, bing, bing, boom, leverage community. Connections are key. When you meet one person, they connect you to the next person, they connect you to the next person. So leveraging community to get faster results. So my challenge for you today is I want you to see one, if you're isolating yourself and you feel very isolated and you're saying, but Heather, I don't have any community around me. You know, we just moved here. You know what I'm going to say to that. You create what you need. I didn't have jack shit. I fucking created it. You feel isolated? Get some get some friends. Don't know how to get friends? Start going to a yoga class. Don't have money to go to yoga? Start a fucking walking club. Talk to your neighbors. Talk to human beings. Say, hey, what do you like to do? Let's be friends. Like, make a friend like your four-year-old would make a friend. And start talking to people and saying, you want to play? This is exactly what I mean, guys. Your brain gets in the way and then you isolate yourself. So start asking yourself, how can I create community? Google Eventbrite, E-V-E-N-T-B-R-I-T-E. Eventbrite is a national platform where people put events on there and sell tickets. Put your local location. I guarantee you, you will find some type of an event that you can attend. Look up meetup.com, M-E-E-T, up, U-P.com. Check out a a local meetup in the area. It might be environmental, it might be food, it might be fitness, it might be parenting. You don't see one locally? Guess what? Create one. Be the change you want to see in the world. And if you are ready to rock the rest of 2019 and 2020, even if you don't want to start in September, you want to start in January of 2020 and kick off the new year, I want to read your application for Soul Elite. This is a mix between one-on-one coaching, group, collaboration, leverage, inner work to see outer results. We're going to look at your health, your personal, mind, body, soul, and we're going to look at your business, your structures. And there's no pressure here. So if you're like, "Mm, something's off and this doesn't feel like the perfect fit for where I'm at, then I'm going to feel it too. And I'm going to might refer you to somebody else or, you know, you come back around when it feels like a good fit. So yes, this is a big investment. There's in-person, there's one-on-one and energetically I'm showing up for you. So I expect you to show up for you as well. So head on over to Heather Chauvin, last name spelled C-H-A-U-V-I-N.com forward slash soul elite. And again, this is for women in business. This is like a next level. You're ready to surround yourself with people who are already um, successful, who are on that level of success. Maybe they achieved the monetary, maybe they achieved the professional goals, but they're looking to up level internally and create a bigger impact and be surrounded with women who, you know, you might feel like a lone wolf. Uh, people might look up to you. You might lead other people and you're just looking for somebody to lead you. So I look forward to reading your application. And if you get it in before the 15th, we have $5,000 of additional bonuses. Um, and that's all I got to say. Challenge yourself to create more community and leverage the community you are already in.